Let's check out what Paula Henderson is doing because she is in her kitchen and she has another recipe showcasing tomatoes. Hi Joe. Well today I am at Henderson's kitchen and I'm very excited that you chose tomatoes to, for our dish today. So tomatoes are very good for your immunity. It's also, it also helps people that have migraines. It is something that we grow locally in Trinidad. And a lot of people, um, there's so many different ways to cook a tomato or eat it. You can eat it raw, you can bake it, you can stir fry it. Um, but today what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna marinate it, right? So by marinating tomatoes, you can add it into your salad, like a salad dressing. You can also put it over toast, or you can serve it with crackers if you're, if you're serving a cheese um, dip or anything like that if you have gas coming. So what you can do, right, or what I have done is I have placed these tomatoes in the oven and I have roasted them, like something like a sun-dried tomato. You could do that if you want, right? Or if you don't have the time, you can just simply just chop them up like this and we're going to place them in the jar. So by doing something like this, um, a tomato marinade, it can, be, it can be kept in your fridge for a longer period of time because we are going to add in lime, which is going to be like the preservative and we're gonna add in some olive oil and some red wine vinegar. Um, we're also adding some basil because basil is really, really good for, um, to boost your immunity as well. It's good for digestion. And um, it's, a great, it's, a, it's a natural herb that um, they have used years ago or a long time for healing. Um, so I got these from my garden. So I'm just gonna show you very quickly how to do, you can do it whole, like what I have here, as well as chop, chop it up. And if you get a cute little jar like this, you can store it nicely in the fridge. I also chopped up some garlic to bring out some great flavors in there, as well as onions, go nicely. I'm also adding in some um, olives, which go nicely in a nice marinade, especially if you're gonna serve it with some cheese. We're gonna add in some salt, some black pepper, the red wine vinegar, some olive oil. You kinda wanna cover the top. A little bit and then some lime and then you're just gonna place your washed basil leaves in there and top it off with some parsley right let's just give it a little stir so now you can keep you can just seal it up keep it in the fridge for a couple hours and then serve it up but here I have the end product that I have done and we're just gonna serve it up with on some toast and that's it you can find the recipe on my website www.paulahenderson.com and I hope you enjoy